from the dark web. The space bag storage pack. So now the bag's empty. Whoops. Never mind. For $48. Oh my gosh. I look like I'm holding boxes when I do this. I'm hiding all this from her, even though it's her birthday present. Let me know if it's pink or purple. Like, I, I can't tell. I always get confused what's semi-formal and like business casual. What's your favorite color? I don't want to be sexist or anything anymore. Or I, I, I don't want to be sexist at all, you know? I don't like flexing. How do you like this lighting? <laughs> Hi everyone, this is Catherine here, or Sincerely Wong. This is going to be the first time I'm actually talking to the camera. So if you have any comments or, or questions, please leave a comment down below. I read all of my comments, the few comments I do get. Thank you to the people who comment. But this is going to be basically going to be a video of me opening this black bag from the dark web. Just kidding, it's not from the dark web. It's from Abercrombie & Fitch. I just bought a lot of stuff for my sister's birthday. So yeah, let's get to it. Okay, these bags are so hard to open. It's not even funny. I've never done a haul video. I've always wanted to do one. Okay, so here's the bag. Okay, so this is a... It's kind of like a windbreaker. I mean, it looks like a space bag storage pack right now because it's all folded, but I'll show you the clothes afterwards. This is a logo shirt. This is a... I don't know. I think they call it a paplem shirt or something. I don't know. I don't know my clothes that well. I don't know fashion that well, so. And this is uh, another t-shirt, long sleeve shirt. I always like to order a size bigger because I like baggier clothes. No reason. Oh, another logo shirt. I also buy men's clothes too sometimes because I like gender neutral clothing sometimes. Another logo shirt. And a sweater. I think that's it. And of course, they have to put this super buff looking hunk on the advertisement with the fierce cologne smell. I love the fierce cologne smell. It smells so good. I think it's the signature Abercrombie and Fitch scent. So I'm gonna unpeel it. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. This is the classic scent. Oh my gosh, this is like throwback. It smells so good. Anyway, so now the bag's empty. Whoops, Never mind. Just so you know, I buy everything 70% off clearance. That's the only time I ever buy something from Hollister and Abercrombie. They have the best sales. Since I gain a lot of points through the membership system, I get like cash back. It's never cash back because you're spending a lot of cash to begin with. Anyway, so let's unbag these clothing. Clothings. Is that even a word? I don't know. As you can see, the original price is like freaking $48. Oh my gosh. I got this sweater for $7.20. So it's a nice V-neck sweater. This looks a little big. What is this? It's a large shoe. Like, what kind of bra are you supposed to wear with this? Frick. Whatever. I might have to go to South Coast Plaza and return this. Okay, whatever. No, it's okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Next. Oh, yeah, this shirt is from Hollister, too. I always buy all my clothes from Hollister and Abercrombie just because I get, like, really good prices and stuff. So it says Abercrombie and Fitch, of course. They love their logos on their shirts. Um, Abercrombie and Fitch. But then you have logo on the side like that. I love this detail. It's so pretty. Or it's not pretty, but it's just like, it's practical, maybe? They like putting their logo everywhere. Abercrombie and Fitch. Uh, I look like I'm holding boxers when I do this. <laughs> it's embroidered, so that's a nice touch to that. The shirt is $28 originally. I got it for $7.65, so this is more than the sweater. Next up, we have... I didn't get any pants in this order, too, so yeah, whatever. I just wear jeans all the time, anyways. Jeans and sweatpants. This is a long sleeve crew neck. Oh my gosh. Okay, so this is a men's shirt. I should have gotten a size smaller. I got a medium. I should have gotten a small. As you can see, they have my favorite logo tape on the side. Because my sister keeps stealing my clothes. So I have to get my own shirt. I'm hiding all this from her, even though it's her birthday present. And then we have here this. I can't tell if this is pink or purple. Let me know if it's pink or purple. Like, I, I can't tell. This shirt here is called a... Long sleeve colored block tee for all you fashionistas out there. As you can see, there's a V shape. I like that. And it's either purple or pink. I'm pretty sure it's, I can't tell. I literally can't. I, they say pink on the website, but it really looks purple to me. So I don't know. Yeah, there's that. Third to last item is the smocked 
waist blouse. I always get confused what's semi-formal and like business casual. Like those are really ambiguous terms that I don't know how to dress for those. But something like this I would wear to work with some dress pants. This is cute. I don't have many green clothes in my dresser or drawer. It's called smocked waist, so it's tight around the waist. Second to last item. What's your favorite color? Let me know. I like knowing people's favorite colors. My favorite color is white, but I have no white clothes from this haul. This is a logo shirt. It's pretty boxy, so not too feminine, but at least it's pink, which is not a feminine color, by the way. It's just it kind of is, but like, yeah. I guess in like, I guess, you know, in uh, baby reveal videos, they have pink and blue, and usually the girl's pink, the boy is blue. So I guess pink is a feminine color, and blue is more of a masculine color, but I don't know. Like, I, I don't want to be sexist or anything anymore. Or I, I, I don't want to be sexist at all, you know? So, pink is a gender neutral color too. I like Abercrombie and Bitches font. It's really classy. Last but not least, we have the... Oh yeah, by the way, I got this shirt for... Okay, I shouldn't say prices. That's weird because then you know how much I'm wearing. That's weird. Never mind. We have a half zip windbreaker that won't open. Come on. There we go. I love this material. Do you hear that? Wow, this is so nice. Oh, what size is this? It is a medium. Okay, I do not like cropped clothes, by the way. Cropped clothes, I don't look good in cropped clothes. Ooh, this is perfect. Yay. Well, that's the end of the haul. This is more of an experimental video, just to see how the viewership goes for this. This is just me showing kind of my style and my taste in clothing. Yes. Those are gonna be my new additions to my wardrobe, so check it out. Okay, Ugh, this is so cringeworthy. <sighs> How do you like this lighting? Let me know. Okay, bye.